Hello, I'm Andrew Listen, welcome back, of course, to another Let's Play Battletech. Uh, we're taking in a somewhat interesting team, Underboss, Medusa, Socks, and Glitch, in uh, Pavel, Corella, Peer, and Ulfur, because a lot of our mechs are damaged, and a lot of our people are injured. A lot of our people. A lot. Like, a lot. A lot. A lot. Now I'm just stalling because of the load times in this game. A lot. 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 That was a lot of load time just to get to the load screen. I've got to say, that's uh, exceptional. A lot. 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 59 seconds. Command Into the video. Not since I pressed the button. That was more like 50 seconds. But still. A hostile lance. Let's deal with it. It's two and a half skull difficulty. Should make Ready it to the fact action. that we've got a subpar lance. Uh, ooh, hello. Flat area here. Right, so there's two ways out of here. You can go around here and you probably end up fighting a force here and a force over here. Or you can go around here, which I... I think I prefer? Move into position. The maps aren't perceived due to generate or anything. They're all, uh, they're all the same. There's a few of them. It takes a while to cotton onto the not procedurally generated, but there, there are a few. Right, um... Good to go! I'm going to put you into this off-cut here because I've gotten the wrong way round. Coordinates received. There we go. On my way. down the gorge. This gorge is a perfect place to ambush someone. They can't really maneuver. You just got the top and you just like pew pew down on them. It's a military tactic. You pew pew down on them. You flank them and catch them in an enfilade. An enfilade? An, infil an, inf an infilade? I don't know. Something. Uh, my way. Crossfire. Uh -huh. It's French. Oh, it looks so diddy compared to the mechs next to you. You know, maybe we'll go around here. On my way. Move order received. Go into the trees as well. I wasn't expecting there to be like another lance. I know they're here, but I was expecting another lance to be over here or something. Maybe this just on the lance. Maybe this isn't one of those missions where they're like, oh, by the way, they've got reinforcements. Maybe it's an honest to god normal Heading fight. Heads up. I lied. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Any reinforcements. <laughs> the timing on that was perfect. I I kid you not. That wasn't like a save scum that I knew they were there. You can't actually, because if you start the mission again, it changes a few things. Um, but that was an honest to God. <laughs> I, I just genuinely didn't know that. Okay, yeah, they've got reinforcements, as I suspected. Hey, Commander, I've got something on my sensors. I'll reserve again. New bogey. That's a fair few tons. That's a 70 ton. Ooh, hello. Cataphract. AC 10, PPC, 4 medium lasers. Armor relatively light. Standing by. So, I'm not going to get too involved. I could move up. But here I can stay in the trees and I can have this block a lot of line of sight. So I'm actually going to stay back here and just... Take a few pot shots. <laughs> get a head chop because I can. Uh, I've gone for uh, half a mil and two picks on this, by the way. Waiting for orders. Commander, 
Yes, Commander. So we're not really going in for full picking up mechs. But, hey, bits and bobs help. Uh, sure. Another head hit. Okay. Uh, you still got evasion, so we use glitch on you. Got it. Right, Earl. You got this. Two large lasers and an LRM-20. Yeah. And now the evasion's gone. Hi. Arm and torso. Unsteady. It's gonna suck to be you next turn. They have got some missiles on turn four. Turn three. Good to go. Under boss. Uh, we're gonna reserve. Okay. You really don't like the Black Knight, do you? Fifty-five tons. What is it? The Shadowhawk. Really don't like me. Uh, I think Waiting we'll take you, our pot shots at you. That's death. Center torso. Oh. Should have run when you had the chance. You really just don't like my mech. Damage is minor. That one in particular. Alright, we're gonna run out into the open. That's a dragon. Yeah, ignore the dragon. Unless it has an AC-20. Do you want an AC-20? AC-5. Nah. You're fine. You've not got any armor for me to... Sorry, you've not got any weapons for me to really worry about. Like, unless you've got a weapon that makes you a threat, you're just a giant, like, metal box. And there's no reason for me to shoot you. Other than the fact that I need to clean you up afterwards. But to begin with, you're not a priority target. Never kill an enemy just because it's the biggest enemy. Kill it because it's the most dangerous enemy. If you kill the most dangerous enemy, you then take less damage. Which means you can do more damage because you're not dead. Aye, aye. Uh, I will do an initiative buff on you. Because it's super cheap. We'll move you up. Cheap initiative buffs on the Ryan are great. And then... Left torso. Right torso. Core. Eliminated. Oh, the dragon looked over. It's full of friend. Oh, poor dragon. Really don't like the Black Knight. I don't know why, but they really focus on the Black Knight. Uh, right. I don't want to use you first. I want to use the boss first because you've got too much evasion. Aye, aye. End damage from a missile is quite tasty. What's this? 55 tons. Griffin? Griffin. Yes, Commander. On it. That'll be overheat. That'll also be overheat. Locked on, yard. Left torso! Almost knocked down. Depends who acts first on initiative two. If I do, I'll knock you down. If you do, you'll prevent that probably. Yeah. It's not a big gun. The Griffin's probably more of a threat than you. You've got an AC5. Eh. The Griffin's got a lot of stuff. It's got an LRM and a, uh, a PPC. It's got partial cover, though. 
So we will do a multi-attack. Use the missiles to try and knock you over. No problem. I've got enough guns for everyone. That's a knockdown. <sighs> Alright, bring it. They have an initiative one here. Oh, that's you knocked down. Okay. Receiving you. I thought that might be something special. Uh, chance of hitting you are pretty low, so we'll just Copy that. finish the dragon off. Actually, you're initiative one, so I'll be able to stamp you next turn to get heat back. Firing. Seems a good plan. Really do not like the Black Knight. Receiving you. All right, go stand on that. Moving out. Putting my weight into it. And then flames. Which killed it! Hostile eliminated. They don't do much damage, they do five each. Okay, sure, shoot path. We're relatively short range of a PPC and you've got three evasion, but whatever. What do you need? We've got breaching shot. We've got high heat. You know what that says to me? It says to me of firing the AC twenty and nothing else. And you've got armor. Locked on. That's the job. Eddie Tun tank. I hear ya. Probably demolish her. Uh huh. Right, breaching shot with the other M20. Fancy there. Thirty five ton. God damn it. Ready for orders. Okay, Pav, get in. You might be able to shut him down with this. Copy that. Pav's always been so useful. Shut him down the heat. Well, not shut him down, but make him a lot less threatening. Alright, so you're overheated. Feel free. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when I come for you? Fire guns, fire guns. No, you're not. I thought you were gonna fire guns because you probably didn't actually have that much. Actually, you've just got terrible heat dissipation. You still got really high heat. Waiting for orders. Um. Oh, now we should probably move up because you're out of range for a lot of other stuff. Coordinates received. We're down to only two shots left of the LRM. So I'm actually just gonna fire the laser. Special delivery. Because I'm pissing and all that. Alright, the tank. I've been sensor locked. Commander. Again, close up that distance. Fire into the AC-20. Taking a shot. Scored a critical hit. 
75 tons. Interesting. I'm interested in you. Standing by. Can I do a death from above? I can do a death from above. I want to do a death from above. A do a death from above! This is a terrible idea. Don't do this at home. Death from above is nearly always a terrible idea. Right torso, right arm, right leg, center torso. Oh, okay. But yeah, we're, in, we're unstable. Our heat's really high. Still a terrible idea. Fine. Okay. Okay. Waiting for order. Um. Ryan. Yeah. Orders. That Orion's gotta die. Kintaro. Ooh, hello. Taking the shot. Okay, that vehicle's a bit of a worry. Good to go. On my way. Glitch move up. I've only got to shot the missiles. Fine. Here we go. I love the heat to go down anyway. The heat was fairly high. Okay, you're unsteady now. Not bad. Receiving you. On my way. Right. Get everything ready to fire. Fire all the guns! Targeting for an alpha strike. Alright, that legs might might go. No, nope. yes, yes it did. And the ammo explosion and knockdown and right torso. Reporting critical hit. Pilot incapacitated? No. One health off. Good to go. You know, I'll vigilance you up. And then I want to land you so that we can see that mech. That. The reason being I vigilanced up is because I want to be able to hit that tank before it comes around the corner. Because it is a demolisher, as I call it. Actually, hit that torso section. Pilot injured. Pilot stole it down. Ah, damn. Solid connection on that one. Triple PPC up on the hill. That changes things a little bit. Really? That's the one you thought was a threat. Ready for order. All right. Moving out. All right, punchy punch, Aging. smash, come on. Boom. Just laser for fun. Right. Enemy vehicle. And the boss. I want to split my attacks, but I, I really want to melee, but I can't get close enough. We could do a death from above. My death from above! Confirm. Oh. That was really lame. The heat's nice, but that was really quite lame. Standing by. Moving out. Right. How much does it take to kill that torso? Not much at all. Eight percent chance to kill you. Copy that. There we go. Target neutralized. Right. In which case. What can I do for you? Glitch. I right, finally laser twice. range. Precise strike. 
Try and go for the head. Fuck that chance. Yes! Headshot! Dang, you're dead! All out of LRM, Commander! <sighs> Worth it. And now that PPC tank can't shoot me because no line of sight. Roger that. Full speed. Unknown vehicle, yeah, I know what it is, mate. Is that just a face? Is that accidental or that? Taking a picture of that. It's a very malevolent building right there. Okay. Ready for orders. Sprint you. All right, full speed. Commander. Gonna jump you so that we can then brace just in case. I hear ya. Moving fast. Ready for orders. Hi, hi. It's a Shrek PPC carrier, did not know. Firing. Totally a surprise. What a revelation. Heads Boom. Up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts. Take inbound. that, you little bastard. <laughs> okay. That's a mission. Tastes like. Oh, it tastes like tea, which is still pretty good. Right. Twelve days. More just in the loot, because we've got Kintaru. Ah, uh, we just get ourselves a full Orion. The Kintaru is only fifty-five tons, so like straight up, probably not going to end up fielding it. But we can have a look. Cataphract. You know what? We'll get a bit of cataphract. Uh, sure. Got ourselves an Orion. We did play a bit hard and fast there. If we'd have got shot in the leg after we death from above, that would have done structural damage to the leg. Wouldn't have taken the leg out. At that point, there weren't enough enemies to really make that a real issue. But it would mean we'd be paying for part of the leg. And then the repair time, which admittedly wouldn't be that long. There's only so much loading time I can fill on these screens, guys. Guitar 18 is a beast machine. It's faster its size. Mounts heavy armor can literally shred most of our mechs. But it runs hotter than Hell's Sauna. That mech is ready. That mech you wanted is back online. We got a Shadowhawk as well. It's Shadowhawk, yeah. Uh, you you can go to storage. Or I could just scrap you for money. Yeah. Alright. Mech bait. Another Orion. Just gonna scrap it because it's quicker. All right, let's look at the Kintaru. It looks a bit of a beast. It looks like a, a mini Black Knight. So what you got? You got two lasers and six missiles. Mm. Missiles are interesting choice to go with. And you've got 17 tons to play with. 17 tons is not a lot, but maybe you're a close in missile platform. Let's have a look. How many missiles can I get on you? With SRM4s, obviously. Because SRM, anything else sucks. Okay. So far, so good. Mm -hmm. Okay, we need the SRM ammo. Which runs at the tune of 100 rounds. We've got 5 firing force. That's 20. Um, so you'll be out in 5 turns. So we probably want... Two buckets minimum. That's ten turns of firing. Uh, I'll make it probably one more. And then we'll get some lasers. 
and heat efficiency is pretty, pretty terrible. Just absolutely trash. Uh, so heat sinks. Now what you don't have is any jump jets. Don't get me wrong, I'm digging a lot of SRM4 splashed all over the place. So that's two, that's 160 damage of SRM4s. And it's an initiative 3 mech. Not accounting for the fact that some of them do extra damage. This is almost 200 points of damage from missiles. And the stability damage as well. Each missile is four. And we've got, what, 20? 80 points of stability damage. I'm tempted to keep it. I don't know if we'll field it very often. Because it's lighter than I like, but... Acting on a faster initiative is always useful. This will be the gray. Okay, so this is going to be the gray. Medium range. Um, What to do about the lack of jump jets? I kind of feel that maybe we just chuck these medium lasers. Like, I know that that's going to cause a problem for some people. Go jump jets, which are only half a ton because they're small jump jets. And sure, we're overweight, but damn, we can move. And there's definitely pros to having a highly mobile mech around. And the armor is... Oh, yeah, we can drop a heatsink as well. Because we drop the medium lasers, we can drop heatsinks because we no longer need them. We'll arm the back up a little bit more. I'm kind of digging this. I can stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with some of my lighter mechs. Not well, sure, you know, I desperately want this in my frontline fighting force, but I certainly want it on my team. If not, you know, actually on the field, certainly in reserve. Yeah, that's a lot of... Slow fixing. Um, you know, what? let's get Gray out in the field quickly. Aurelio, you don't need to be out in the field particularly fast because I've got other snipers. You two, you're just going to take a long time equally. So I think maybe Bradley is slightly more important, but oh, yeah. Got a new financial report coming soon. We got any contracts? We have got a contract here. Pride and vanity. A battle. Uh, family set with local power organization. They're threatening military action against the restoration neighbors in the Rand's fate. Neighbors is a low claim. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Need done out of all assets. Okay, sure. Well, I guess that's what we'll be doing, but that'll be next time. I know this has been a shorter episode, but I need to go stream. So uh, I will catch you over Twitch or TV forward slash Andrew Lessing. But until next time, like, subscribe, and stay shiny. If you're watching this video, I don't mean stream as you're watching this video, unless it's just a crazy happenstance, because this is recorded in advance, if you hadn't guessed. I'm wearing the same top as yesterday. Yesterday's video, not yesterday. Yeah, it's a different top. Either way, like, subscribe, and stay shiny.